Hi everyone, I'm Allie Grayman. I'm an OCD recovery coach. On this channel, we talk about how to fully recover from OCD. Full recovery is absolutely possible. I recovered, my clients recovered, and you can recover too. Today, I want to talk to you about how living in uncertainty affects self-esteem. So a lot of the times you will hear this advice of you need to live with the uncertainty. Maybe you've killed somebody and forgot, maybe not. Maybe you've uh, went against God, maybe not. Maybe something bad is going to happen because you've, I don't know, moved a cup, maybe not. You have to live with that uncertainty. You have to, you feel like you're a bad person, you have to live with that uncertainty. And you hear this over and over again. The question is this. First of all, why are you accepting thoughts that are not real, even as a possibility? And second of all, where's your self-esteem going to be if you're accepting that you're a bad person in this way, you're a bad person in that way, you can do wrong in this way, you can do wrong in that way? I mean, it's not a self-esteem builder. So instead of doing that, just do the thing that makes sense. View it as an OCD symptom. These thoughts that are coming into your mind they're nothing. They're just a symptom of OCD. Make a choice to disregard. Make a choice to push through. You don't need to accept the maybe possibility. You need to accept that you have OCD. And not only you have this theme, whatever theme that you're dealing with, your theme is so common that it has a name. H-O-C-D, R-O-C-D. It has a name. So many people are struggling with it. So you're not alone in suffering. Your thoughts are not unique. You need to accept these thoughts since they're not unique as a common symptom of OCD. And the more you do that, the weaker they will become. You don't need to accept make-believe stuff. I promise you, do this. Reduce rumination, reduce compulsions, reduce avoidances. You will recover. You just got to stay strong and keep going. Thank you so much for listening. I will be back tomorrow with another video if you would like to do one-on-one -on -one recovery program with me. As always, it's all on youhaveocd.com. Subscribe if you haven't. I'll see you tomorrow.